Hi guys, it's Adria. Welcome back to my channel. Today, honestly kind of feel like I'm asleep right now because I wasn't expecting to film this video. This is very much to my own surprise. Little quick story time. Uh, so y'all know I started a new job recently. I was at said job and I was doing an activity at that job that I really hate. While doing it, my phone flipped out of my back pocket, which I usually lock in with my belt, but didn't because I just went to the restroom. Somehow I still destroyed the phone, even with the screen protect. I given up. I got punished because I was having a mental breakdown and threw my phone down the stairs. It didn't break and I was like, okay, you know what? Never doing that again. Yeah, you know what? Y'all are here for the unboxing, so let's just open it up. Um, okay, this is kind of weird. What the hell? Okay, I've never seen this kind of bubble wrap, but we don't really care about that. Okay, the receipt and everything. Nobody cares. Nobody gives a flying shit. So right now I have the iPhone 8 Plus. Before that I had the iPhone SE. And then before that I had the iPhone 4S. And then before that the 4. So this is like, this is like my fifth iPhone in the span of like seven years. Are you guys ready? I may have to rip this off because it has my phone number on the side of it. <laughs> da, 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 da. Okay. Okay. Hi, y'all. <laughs> I'm gonna cry. <laughs> okay, so this is the yellow iPhone 11 Plus. Or 11? Not the Plus. This was free. This was 100% free. Brandon bought this for me because I never would have bought this for myself. I just, I don't know. I just wouldn't. How much did he even spend on this? Did he buy this like straight up or do I have to make payments on Like, I. You're all here for this. Oh, what an exciting video. I don't even know how to turn it on. Oh, uh, when you think it comes with AirPods, but the cord is just, <laughs> they know what they're doing with this packaging, y'all. Oh, I don't even have the, I don't have a home button. This is gonna be weird. When I was holding this, my finger was like up by the camera because the camera comes down so low. So like that's, that feels, my phone can't be activated right now. I'm gonna compare it to the 8 Plus for you. Do you like my stickers? <laughs> it's a little bit smaller, just slightly, the new one. It looks a tad thicker. Is she thicker? <laughs> hmm. Little bit thicker, it looks like. I don't know the dimensions of this thing, but obviously the camera. It's like visibly smaller. It does fit in my hand better, which I like. I don't know if I ever, I mean, yeah, I got used to holding this, but it took a while. So yeah, let me try to figure out how to activate this. I feel kind of spoiled, honestly, and I kind of feel like I don't deserve this. I feel like Brandon's just gonna be like, psych, it's mine. I feel the need to give him $800. <laughs> Was it a free upgrade or is he paying for it monthly or am I gonna pay for it monthly? Like, ugh. Okay, it says paid today $51. That makes a bit more sense. <laughs> I guess it's not free to me. <laughs> I guess I'm gonna have to pay for it. I mean, I haven't paid anything for it so far, so it feels pretty free. I'm a mess. All right, I'm gonna go set this up because I just set them up. Just set them up. Absolutely nobody me in 2011. All right. Two hours later. Okay, literally two hours later. I don't know why this was so hard to set up, probably because I should have backed up my phone in advance. So a few notes here. One, I'm not used to not having a home button yet. I am going to miss my old sloth phone case. I don't know how I feel about the camera. Let me try taking a camera in this lighting. Taking a camera, let me. <laughs> oh, ooh, it's very wide is the first thing I'm noticing. It pushes everything really far away, which is cool. That can make taking a selfie pretty easy behind the scenes of taking a selfie. It's really clear. I'll try taking one with the back camera. Oh my gosh, so clear. 
I was seeing memes on TikTok of like the cameras being kind of wonky and everything like that, but I like how it kind of pushes everything farther away. It doesn't feel like everything's right up close to it. So I got it all set up. So I'll do a quick what's on my iPhone. I'll put it like right here on the screen so you guys can see it from top left to right. We got the camera, photos, calendar, weather, Facebook, Twitter, Instagram, YouTube. Then we have this folder called other social and in there I have Facebook Messenger, YouNow, Yelp, and Snapchat. Then we have finance folder, banking, PayPal, Receipt Hog, Amazon, Wallet, Mercari, and TurboTax. I like Receipt Hog because that is a way to earn money through just scanning receipts. Not Spons, but I've been using that for years. Then we just have Bitmoji, Maps, iTunes, App Store, Clock, Notes, Calculator, and Measure. Then we have Contacts, Voice Memos, Find My iPhone, Pages, Numbers, Files, Clips, Keynote, and iTunes U. Then the next folder is called Editors. We have Line Camera, Clean Repost, Layout, Pro Knockout, Vapor Cam, RFV, InstaFit 2, Live Wallpapers. I don't know how to undo this, now they're all bouncing. Because before I would hit the home button, what do I do? Okay, okay, <laughs> so. Then we have books, we have the dictionary, Bible inspirations and the Bible. Then we have my games folder, which we have fight list, that's you, webkins. <laughs> I'm so exposed right now. Candy Crush, Tofu, Roller Coaster Tycoon, and Bricks and Balls. Tofu's really relaxing, you can just like, flip the tofu around and you have to get it to match up on the board. I'll just show you guys one. See, so you're just rolling it and you have to get it to land on the little red square. They get harder though, but. Um, then we have my health folder. So we have health, monthly cycles, peace, Nike Run Club, and Hilo. Then we have my FaceTime. Then we have food, so embarrassing. <laughs> uh, we have DoorDash and Chick-fil-A. Safari, the work folder, which has FameBit, Patreon, Teespring, Indeed Jobs, TubeBuddy, and Collab Space. I have Life360. Oops. Then we have TikTok, Pokemon Go, GoPro, uh, Discover, oh, Shortcuts? I don't know what Shortcuts is, that's like new on this phone. Entertainment, we have Netflix, PetCube, Kwai, Webtoons, and 100 Picks. Reminders, uh, my travel folder which has Uber, Uber Eats, Frontier, and Hopper. Hopper is an app that can help you find like cheap flights, which has been pretty helpful. Then we have Lifestyle. These are like wedding planning apps, Zola, The Knot, and Twine. Then we have Episode, which I just recently re-downloaded. If you guys want a video of me playing Episode, I can do that. Answer this poll if you guys would like to see me play Episode in an upcoming video. I'm kind of like looking for new things to try. Click that, it's the little eye icon, so. It's something I play when I'm not Okay, I'm gonna have an episode. We have the Apple Store, AT&T Mobile Transfer, which I can actually delete this. How do I just, okay, there we go. Garage Band, ooh, that's new on the iPhone, and AT&T, so yeah, that's everything. Oh, and at the bottom, we have the phone, settings, text, and email, so that's everything on my iPhone. Yeah, because I get asked a lot to do, like, what's on my iPhone. I really don't feel like I have that many interesting things to show. Oh, I also set up the face recognition thing, which is... <laughs> I wanted to try to set up my Animoji so you guys could see it, but I don't know how to do that. I was the only loser in my family that couldn't do Animoji. Even my mom could do Animoji. Oh, this is so cute. How do I make me? Oh, here we go. Okay. Oh, it's already copying my face. That's so weird. I'm pretty pale. I'm kind of pink. I can have some red cheeks. Those brows though, girl. All these don't look like my hair. I guess that could be, yeah, that's pretty good, okay. Does this look like me? Wow, they even give you the option to do brow piercing as a blue. <gasps> don't you feel like you don't know what you look like once you're trying to create yourself? Like, I've never successfully been able to create myself on The Sims. <laughs> That was me unboxing my new iPhone 11 in yellow. I hope that you guys enjoyed. If you wanna see any of my other iPhone unboxings, I will link them in the description because I have done a couple in the past. I did get a new laptop, but I never did an unboxing of it and I don't know why. Anyway, yeah, if you guys enjoyed, don't forget to hit the thumbs up and subscribe. I post new videos Mondays and Fridays. I did take a little bit of a hiatus, not really on purpose. I just, um, yeah, was kind of in like a mental 
funk. So hopefully I'll be getting back into the groove and swing of things. I will see you guys again next time. Until then, panda hugs. Love you guys. Goodbye.